President Joe Biden made remarks about his economic plan in Bay City, Michigan on Tuesday. Michigan Governor Gretchen Whitmer praised past legislation he has signed into law, including the Bipartisan Infrastructure Law, the Inflation Reduction Act, and the Chips and Science Act, which she described as, quote, bringing the supply chains home. The Democratic governor won her re-election against Trump-backed Tudor Dixon earlier this month. Can be found right here in the great state of Michigan. We hustled hard to forge this partnership, and I know it will pay off for decades to come, for future generations to come in Michigan. But more than anything, I am proud that this investment makes a real difference in people's lives, because that's what this is all about. People like Brian, who is an R&D tech at this facility. This gentleman, Brian, was born and raised right here in and around Bay City, and it's his home. And he knows that the work he does right here in his community and the people around the world rely on SK's products. He has a good paying job with great benefits right near his family in his hometown. And isn't that what we all want? To do meaningful work close to our loved ones? I don't know, maybe it's too close to the holiday to answer that yes, right? <laughs> now that promise is what helped Michigan build the middle class. It is exactly that kind of work that guides the work of leaders like President Biden and Congressman Kildee and the work that we're doing at the state of Michigan. We want to work together to ensure that everyone has a great quality of life and a good cost of living. And that instinct drives local efforts, like Saginaw's ISD's Youth Ambassadors. Now that's a scholarship and leadership development program for local students, and it results in game-changing progress for the American people. By staying focused on the fundamentals, we are getting things done. The bipartisan infrastructure law is helping us fix the damn roads, protect clean drinking water, and connect homes to high-speed internet. And the Inflation Reduction Act will lower costs on everything from prescription drugs to health care to energy and bring $8.3 billion worth of clean energy investments to the state of Michigan. And of course, we're here at SK Siltron, and I want to highlight the Bipartisan Chips and Science Act, which is bringing the supply chains home cutting delays, cutting shortages, cutting costs, and unleashing the power of American manufacturing to help us land more projects just like this one. We all want the future of chips and cars and computers and clean energy to be stamped with the words that make us proud, made in the USA, and better yet, made in Michigan. <laughs> The Chips and Science Act and companies like SK Siltron are making that future a reality. Now, I believe in Michigan, and so, so does SK Siltron, because we know what we are capable of here. We are a hub of manufacturing and a magnet for bipartisan progress. And thanks to leaders like President Biden and Congressman Kildee and so many other local par par partners, we have the resources to achieve our ambitious goals. Let's keep listening. Let's keep working together. Let's keep getting things done and keep moving Michigan forward. And with that, it's my honor to introduce our next speaker who's going to introduce the president, Jeffrey Xavier Dukes from UA Local 85. <laughs> 